What's happened October 8th? Cry baby police chief pulled over. We're not doing this. No, sir. Uh, the reason why we're stopping you is well, because oh, of the intent dude. violation. I blinked my blue lights at you to let you know who I was. Yes, sir. Well, we didn't know with it, you know, that's not a government tag. That is, a, that is a unofficial tag. Right. That, that tag's not even on file. I see. Yes. Well, we have to catch up. Who's that on file? I'm for damn sure pulling it over. Like, well, who are you? Also, who are you to walk up to my patrol vehicle like this? Bro, I'll tell you what. There'd be some ignorant bullshit going on. <laughs> if somebody approached my vehicle like this. Bill to run it and everything like that, sir. So, so I won't blink my blue lights at you next time. I'll let well, you just sit there. I was just speaking. I'm the police chief in Zebra. Well, like, I'd give a Matt, Matt Polk worked for me. Your I'll chief worked for me. Yes, sir. There's no need to get upset. I, I'm, I'm, I'm upset because I spoke to you. When I come by and now you're pulling me Sir, over. I've never met you damn my life. I understand Where? that. Why are you being hostile? Easy. I don't I don't have to talk to you. Okay. I'm not, I'm not talking to you. Why are you being hostile right now? Do y'all are y'all gonna write me a ticket? Are you gonna write me a ticket? Sir, we're just trying. I'm the police chief in Zebra. Do you wanna write me a ticket? Why are you coming up to me like you that? Me I'm doing my job, right? What are you stopping for? I'm stopping for one because we're gonna start. I have blue lights in my car. Okay, you know how many uh, officers that are working? Are you writing me a ticket, yes or no? Are you writing me a ticket? I'm just... They don't have to disclose whether they're writing you a ticket or not. You would know that if you knew anything about anything, or you're just like a little dipshit that got promoted because nepotism. And you know the thing we were complaining about, like the way What's her face managed. Again? Yeah, fuck this guy. I'm a cop. What more do you want? At best, let's say they're cool with everything whatever let's say it's all in the up and up and they still decide to cite you right at best you're looking like a 60 to 70 dollar citation right either way hang out let the cops do their thing it's what i tell anyone else that does not change just because you're the police chief of some place that's got five people in it like who is this guy like <laughs> bro Dude, I'm team Antifa here. I'm team the whole nine <laughs> yards, man. Like, fuck this guy. Fucking ACAP. Burn down their two houses in a gas station. Yeah, yeah, dude, I'm here for this it. Oh, town. my God. God. Emily, you've seen this. On a scale from one to ten, how mad am I going to be? I'm nervous <laughs> about this one. Cuff him, Plank Forge. I love you. He's giving me pre-attack you know cues is what I'm seeing here. I was, I was literally about to say, I was like, you know what? The other thing about this is I would consider all this. And you know what? Pennsylvania v. Mims allows me to <laughs> go ahead and detain this guy That's while it. I conduct my investigative stuff. He cannot order. When you are not operating in your official capacity, you have no authority. You have negative. This is why I had this discussion earlier about your duty to intervene changes when you are not on duty. I am retired. I did the on duty stuff. I had the gun and the badge and the authority and, the, and all that kind of stuff. If someone pulls me over, oh, I was a former police officer, <laughs> I'd be just as mad, dude. He and I have the same amount of authority in this crap and stuff. Juan has the same amount of authority on this traffic stop as old police chief because he's currently right now being investigated for I have slightly more because I pay your salary, but I pay your salary. <laughs> Who shared this? <laughs> <laughs> it might have been me. I think I, I think it was either me or it was Poofy. Well, I know I really like sharing the ones that make you pissed off. So this is also gonna fall under official oppression by using the color of his, this is the way that the law writes in Texas, the color of his authority to force or compel someone to do something. He is trying to compel, not even technically a subordinate, just a peace officer, because of his position as a police chief, he is abusing that position to try to force that officer to do something while they're due to trap. So this would be a felony in the state of Texas. Tennessee versus Gardner him. Come on, no, that's not like <laughs> Fleeing felons, what I'm seeing. <laughs> you need, you need to Although, <laughs> official oppression is a felony. That's what I'm saying. 
I should be convinced him to run. Yeah. Um, you just said it. The second he turned his back, yeah. sounds like he's gonna run. He's not in his just pockets. I, don't, I was about to say, I'd also tell for his life. Yeah. Uh, there's a high likelihood that you're armed, and I don't need you reaching for your, for your pockets. I'd make him do it. And if you refuse to do that, I'd cuff him. No shit to do. I can say this because I'm here. These poor people, this guy might as well be. He's so protected by the institution that mm -hmm. put him in place. This is literally... This is this is why people hate police officers. So you know what? If I was them, I'd hate them too. Bravo, Frank Mike, 1175, BFM, 1175. Running the plate like you're supposed to. Dude, in tiny towns like this, yeah. he might as well be God. Yeah, shout out to the Mike Loop. I hate that he's taking his radio off his belt. But seriously, though, in tiny towns, he might as well. Blank Forge, I don't know if that's a court case. Um, and <laughs> Perilous Mastodon, <laughs> I know a guy that became an MP. Left because he couldn't stand the corruption. Became a police officer. Left for the same reason. And he currently trains. Oh all my god! Do this dude's like he's batting a thousand, isn't he? <laughs> <laughs> uh, I'm so mad. This has me more mad than anything we just watched. I just watched cops die, and this still pisses me off more. I don't know why. Explaining. I don't want to hear that. Okay. You let her do her job. 48 returns to a 2001 Dodge Ram truck. Black color to machine construction company. Are you letting him get back in his car, Josh? Truck? This doesn't retire. This doesn't even return to the same vehicle. I'm seizing the plate, to be honest. And I'm probably not letting him get back in his vehicle. I'm going to go ahead and stick him in the back of the truck. I get it that technically they could verify his employment that he's a police chief. That doesn't change the fact that he's currently committing a crime and he's currently detained. Like, it's procedural justice. You motherfucker, you're going to sit on the... I'd make that motherfucker sit on the curb. Mm -hmm. Outside. I'd find an amp pile and make sure he sits there. This is so stupid. Oh, Pamela says he gets worse. <laughs> oh, uh, oh. <laughs> I'm only two minutes in. Uh. Christian Holsey oh, shared this one. I wish I had. I swear, Christian. <laughs> We're going to fight one day. That's so I'd seize the blade. You're not allowed to operate a motor vehicle on a public roadway without a valid license plate. And if you display a fake one, it's a crime. I don't care why you're doing it. The only way you get away with this is if you are currently doing your job undercover or some bullshit. And even then, they'd give you a plate that had a valid return. Like, you're not above the law. And he shouldn't even be driving a car that's got blues on him unless he's doing it for a business reason. And if they have take-home cars, it's a pretty big violation of, of general orders to utilize your lights because you're not in the commission of your job. Like you're not doing, you can't use emergency lights for fun. If you're off duty, you can't use them at all, <laughs> period. The only thing that might absolve you of that is if under exigent circumstances, you're watching someone that, that's about to go set a school on fire or some crazy shit. And you're gonna say, yes, I committed all these crimes off duty because I wanted to do this and hope that the system takes mercy on you for doing that. It, this is so like, <sighs> Read uh, Blake Forge's comment. <laughs> right, right, right. <laughs> I'd rather it return there. Fucking <laughs> <Like playing. laughs> There is no curb. Then he sits in the grass. Fuck him. Yep. You can sit on those yellow poles. 11, 8, 11, 11. Make sure you're recording. Yeah. Dark tent. She's about bringing your jars. That's why they pulled them over originally. Yeah. Um, that is first that is like zero percent tent. Like mm -hmm. there is no light transmission. And then he flashed up his blues to say, "I'm a cop too. Leave me alone." It doesn't. Oh my god. Yep. Oh, it's official pressure. You're why cops get killed on duty mm -hmm. over hate crimes. That's why they get ambushed by freaking dirtbags. Every time someone says A cab, they're, they're 
truly talking about you, but you're the reason why it gets said. Mm -hmm. it, it filters back down to the peons on the ground. Yep. The tag came back Where's, to like uh, a dollar grand. What's so his face that was here earlier? Decided to leave before we got to this part. Hey, you get to watch me dunk on this guy. I hate this guy. Mm -hmm. I hate H-A-T. Yeah. I mean that. The Lord tells me I have to do it, but it's hard. To fund that guy and spread his salary to like the, Bro, the three I officers wish... in his department. I wish they would flog this guy <laughs> in time in in the public square. <laughs> All three buildings that are on yeah. their main street. He shouldn't. If this is a city paid for car, I swear I'm going to become a domestic terrorist. Like this makes me so <laughs> mad. This makes me so mad. If this is a city paid for vehicle that he's using, like. <sighs> harmless. Yes, sir. It's a ghost tag. Yes, sir. We'll make no, no, sure no, 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 it's a ghost tag. You shouldn't be allowed to have ghost tags. And if you're going to use something that doesn't return correctly, it should only be under circumstances that are used on you. I don't care how you feel about that. If you don't like that, unsubscribe. <laughs> Please. Yes, sir. Yeah, we're just. You must have run it wrong. You must have run it wrong because you want to come back to a dog ranch. We, we were confirmed they, they, they let us know the time. So, so it's still coming back to a Dodge Ram now? Sir, can, can I ask why you're uh -uh. so upset? Is it still coming back to a Dodge Ram No, we, we got it. The kid in the McDonald's parking lot got shot for less. Couldn't the San Antonio McDonald's shooting guy be on mm -hmm. this call? Mm -hmm. I just, life is so unfair, dude. Like, this is crushing my soul. I'm going to make myself finish watching this for y'all, but just know I hope this is worth the views. You better like the damn stream because this is killing me slowly. I'm like, I can feel my blood pressure going up. <laughs> I hate this guy so much. I hope somehow magically, somehow magically, I hope this turd somehow magically sees this. And if he sees this, and if you're looking at my face right now, go fuck yourself. If you got a problem with me saying that, come find me. I'm in Texas. DM me. I'll come meet you. Go punch you in the wiener. <laughs> Fix. Why are you so upset? No, you didn't fix it. Did is it still right. coming back to a Dodge Ram right now? No, it came back not on five. That's right. Okay. Cause you run it wrong, sir. Somebody about, run it wrong. Either to, you did or they did. We're about to get the information. Okay. And get I got your to chief you. on the phone right now. That's yes, fine. Sir. That's I, fine. Like I give a fuck. <laughs> That'd be me. Like okay, cool. I don't give a shit. Bro, he's got an American flag pin on his shirt. <laughs> ah, you're an affront. You're an affront to everything. You're a tyrant. We killed people like you to make this country. Just know that. And the I freedom, can't... the freedom under armor shirt too. Look at that. I, the I, irony I, is fully I, lost I, I, on this I, guy. I appreciate your service. I appreciate okay. your service. All right. I'm just saying. I spoke to you guys. I didn't have to do that. I could have eased on by y'all. I... The fuck? Nah, no, you're, you're not. Big, I, you're good, I, bro. I, I, why can't please brutality? Pit have that guy. Here? Pit that guy. <laughs> Fearless Mastodon, thank you. <laughs> I appreciate. Thank you for thanking me for my service here on the internet. I hate these so much. I'm having fun. <laughs> <laughs> I'm trying to be respectful with you. I understand okay? that. I understand. I'm not. That. I'm not raising my voice for nothing at you, that. right? I understand. All right, let's. But man I'm trying man, to tell you. The only okay. thing I done wrong was spoke. Y'all never would have pulled me over if I had to flick my blue lights. No, at sir. You. No, we were gonna pull you. For damn sure, I'm pulling you over. You have zero proof tent and a tag that doesn't return. Like, I would pursue you for less because this is like a reeks of stolen car. Like. Dude, like, there's nothing about this. Like, remember I was, like, arguing about the dude with burglary warrants? Like, mm -hmm. I was like, you got a shirtless vato <laughs> with a bike. And I'm like, I don't know, man. They don't got a detention. But here, I'm like... <laughs> and he knew the law better than this asshole. <laughs> how, how on earth... I, this is my Patreon group. This is what you people do to me. You managed to pull me two videos that make me root for the crackhead and the burglary suspect and root against the police chief. I y'all killed me. Actually, I mean, I'm no, not going to lie to you. I'm no, telling you, you straight up, okay? okay. Right. But like I said, you know, there's people out here in person, police officer with blue lights. Well, you threw my or she threw my license. If she is getting them for me. She'll bring it to you, sir. Okay, well, that's fine. I'm just she trying will get to, it when she's I'm done, trying to talk with you. I don't want to talk anymore about it. All righty. 
Yeah, it's very unprofessional. To say the least, yeah. That's, I would have said something different, but I get it. She was told by her higher ups to let him go. That would have been the last day I wore that uniform at that police department. I probably would have made it that long, to be honest. Like I, I complained a lot about my administrators. They never did this bullshit. They would have never. They wouldn't have made it in a town the size of the one that I worked in. That wouldn't fly. Bro, you get police chiefs getting canned for way less than this. You say the wrong thing in a tweet and you're gone. This guy's over here like trying to big dick swing it with an illegal tag on their high end. Hold on. What was the disposition here? I need to know. Juan, can you Google this? Tell me yeah. this guy got like fired. Or Pamela shit. says it gets better at the end. I guess that must be where we are at. Well, it's less douchey. No, I don't think. I, no, I think she means like you're gonna get more mad. Fucking Pamela. Yeah. <laughs> Write that citation. Blank Forge, I'd have, I'd have tried to arrest the guy on the citation. It's just so stupid. Yeah, here we go. Um, it's the... He's facing the criticism. <laughs> Poor joke. Um, Molina's police chief, Matt Polk, supports the cops who pulled over Hemp, hemp Hill. I don't know why the traffic stop transpired the way it did, but I'm very proud of my officers for the way that they handled it, Chief Polk said. I commend those officers because there is a power imbalance. They're just trying to do their job. They did not back down. For citizens, you want officers like that who reinforce the law no matter who it is. Okay. Shout out to Chief Folk, Polk. Yeah, shout uh, out to, to, to Chief Johnson or whoever this guy is because he's he's keeping it a gangster. Chief and he's Polk. backing his Matt officers. Polk. Yeah. Matt Polk. Uh, let's just tag the ground that there's in dredgements. He just peacefully was stopped. An officer explained it due to the tint of his windows. Hemp Hill cursed back. Um, it doesn't really say... Anything else beyond that? I want, I want resolution. I yeah. want blood. Oh, here we go. Police one. Does police one have something? Okay. Hold on. I'm, I'm gonna, we're going to the next one. Read, and if you got an update, tell me. Okay. Um, he stopped the other PO. Stopped their 911 calls. What the fuck? Bro, this guy's a super villain. A uh, nice example of administrative corruption. Shimang, I agree 1,000%. There is not a better... That is cotton 4K. That is straight... That is corruption. That is that is a misappropriation and an abuse of power. There's all the bad things wrapped into one. Because like I said, a kid got killed over a Happy Meal, dude. And this guy's getting to walk around and swing his car open and do furtive movements and all this. I don't know, dude. Like... I don't know, man. Oh, shoot. Okay. So Atlanta News Station's aired footage of the traffic stop and alleged that Hemphill retaliated against MPD officers by blocking their emergency radio channel. The ZPD and MPD shared an emergency radio channel, but after Hemphill was pulled over in Molina, the city was blocked from using the frequency. Molina was forced to ask to use the Pike County Sheriff's Office emergency radio channel. This dude. Okay. I won't say what I want to say because there's, there's a certain line on the internet where I end up getting somewhere bad. However, if you happen to be like a first amendment auditor or whatever, and you somehow come across this, where's this at? Uh, it's uh, so he's from Zebulon, Georgia, go to Zebulon, Georgia and ask specifically for this guy and go make his day miserable. I just, this is fucking outrageous, dude. There's zero reason for that bullshit. Yeah. Looks like this right. happened like five days ago, so there's not a lot of resolution that we can get yet, unfortunately. I don't know, man. <sighs> that. Oh, jeez. Uh, that guy just gets to walk away. I would have slammed him on the ground. Uh, Gadoff Games? Is that whatever this is? Shout out to you. And I wish you were the cop that was there. I wish you were empowered with the ability to go and, and do what normally I would super criticize um, and say, fuck it, and totally, totally blessed. Uh, Reese, what's going on? Uh, sounds FCC illegal to block a frequency, 1,000%. Uh, I think maybe a lot of times what happens is you'll have like a joint uh, agreement. They might pay for the tower. And they might pay for the, it's like a, a government frequency. So they'll project a frequency 
or a bandwidth or whatever. Uh, and they'll allow other agencies to use it if you're passing through or whatever. You have like a like a joint clause for it. I, mm-hmm. I guess he thought people dying in an emergency situation weren't that important. And he's so petty over being stopped by a traffic stop that he thought uh, interfering with that is super important. I hope he goes to prison. I hope they find out he was a police chief. And I hope they make his, the rest of his hopefully short life miserable. Fuck that guy. Fuck everything about him. I have zero... I'm less mad. I, it just kind of blows my mind, like, how that's even allowed to happen. Truly, for me, like, I don't know how that doesn't get demonstrated. And it's not. Same thing with the chick that got pulled over for the domestic. Mm hmm. Yeah. Like, you're not special, dude. <laughs> like, like, when people bitch about qualified immunity, these are the instances where they need to be bitching because they got, like, de facto qualified immunity from being total shits and getting force used on them and not complying with investigations. Like, cause this is like subtextual qualified immunity. If they actually tried to adjudicate the law and actually tried to use force, and try to do all that should have been kosher. We shouldn't be subjects. We're citizens. And these are servants of the state. These are meant to, 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 they are just as, as, as above you as, as waiters. Their job is to serve the public, not to be fucking dicks and play by their own rules. Fucking bullshit. Um, nah, bro. He stepped out of the car. <laughs> That's immediately a threat. He's not wrong. I'm mm-hmm. not even going to hear an argument. I, I agree completely. He was probably very likely to be armed, so you would have had every reason to sit there and detain him the second he started making part of food while being detained. Mm-hmm. You're allowed to control the safety of that traffic stop. And based on his behavior, I didn't trust that he was going to be safe with that. You don't just automatically disarm them just because you know they're armed. It's that, the furtive movement and the aggressive behavior. And failing to, to, to comply with all lawful orders given to somebody while they're detained. I could have articulated the shit out of disarming that guy. Uh, Chris is now with access to All right, let's get this back on track. Let's get this back on track. Come on, boys. Come on, boys. And Pamela.